seen in the other weeks? Um, no, not much. I mean, they're going to play us tough, and, and they're going to come and hit us. So, But, I mean, schematically not much different. Just got to go out there and do our thing. Yeah, three-man front? Or? Yeah. Is that, I mean, that's got some complications or challenges in it, right? Yeah, I think just protection-wise, obviously we got to adjust some things, but it's nothing that we haven't seen before, so we can do it. What stood out to you from the uh, tape of the Old Dominion game, I mean, particularly as you evaluated your, your performance, what stuck out? Um, I think uh, I think we started off slow, and then, like Coach said, I think we ended poorly. But I think in the middle of the game, I think we we started to get it going, running the ball and completing some balls downfield. So I think right now we just got to focus on is, like I said, just starting off a little bit faster, get it going, and, and finish strong. I think this will be the kind of game where. Assuming you have James back, both of those guys can really can get rolling and maybe get the running game continue from last week. Absolutely, I think. I mean, especially with Isaac the way he performed and, and James coming back, hopefully, and I think we'll be good running the ball. I think nothing's going to change from last week, and we'll just pound the ball down. Is that ultimately, I mean, what you would say if you grew up the perfect day for this offense? Is that what it would be? You know, pounding the ball on the ground and then you taking shots deep? Is that? Um. Yeah, I mean, I, I, I think that's up to coach. I think whatever he's in the mood to do, really. I, think, I mean, I know we can do both. Kevin Beck, what does he bring besides just another good target to throw to? Um, I think he brings a lot. I mean, I think he brings consistency back. I think he brings the leadership. I mean, he's been here. He's he's the face of the program here. And, uh, I mean, just seeing him out there is comforting for the rest of the team. So I think he brings a whole different aspect mm -hmm. on and off the field. Throwing a ton of your passes to Devin and Tyler, obviously, because I mean, those are guys that can go all the way. But I think you had a few passes to JP on, on Saturday, and Manessa had a few. What, what can those guys, you know, is their role still developing? I mean, as far as the tight ends, as far as how they fit into the passing game, is that still kind of an ongoing process? Yeah, I mean, I think everything. I mean, I think with all the receivers, it's ongoing. But I think we see a lot of mismatches with those guys, and, and they're tremendous athletes. So I think we can. We can get a mismatch on some guys and, and take advantage of it. And we're confident in all three of our tight ends to go down and make plays for us. So. They ever lobby you? Say, you know, hey, throw it to us too or anything like that? <laughs> no, not much. They're, they're, they're tight ends. They're happy with whatever out there. Just want to hit somebody. Anything else? Thanks. Good.